It's affecting a lot of families across Alabama, including a family in Vestavia Hills. Alicia Brooks got confirmation she had COVID-19 on Sunday, but she says she has taken every precaution not to get sick and did not expect to get it. But CBS 42 News reporter Hillary Simon spoke with Alicia on video chat. And Hillary, I understand she told you she's been sick for about two weeks now. Art, that's right. She said she started showing symptoms about two weekends ago. She went to get herself tested on a Tuesday, and it took all the way till Sunday, almost a week for her to be confirmed that, yes, she has tested positive for COVID-19. She says she's in that high-risk group. She has multiple sclerosis. She should, she's a diabetic and a cancer survivor. She already was isolating herself, she says, and she was not leaving the house. She said she had a fever up to 103, massive headaches, body aches, and a semi-dry cough. Alicia is also a former nurse, and she believes she caught the virus by simply helping unload groceries. I um, was surprised. Uh, I, you know, took every precaution, still got it. That's kind of what's scary about this, is that um, even when some people are taking all the precautions in the world, you never know who has it because some people are asymptomatic or show no symptoms. And she says her husband has also been cleaning himself every time he comes home from the store or an errand. She says the biggest thing she misses is just hugging her 11 year old daughter. Now she says her big message to everyone is to take this seriously because she was taking this seriously from the beginning and she caught COVID-19. And she just says everybody to please stay home to protect you, your family, loved ones, and everyone around you. Art, back to you. Important words from that woman in Vestavia Hills. Uh, thanks a lot, Hillary.